Well, good morning, folks. I was noticing a Facebook page or a Facebook comment that uh, there's Tim Hortons trash all over the place, and it, it reminded me of a conversation I had with a friend of mine who uh, avidly goes to Tim's, and he said that uh, Tim's removed the garbage can. And so we're just going to take a little peek here and see if that's true. Evidently, there used to be a garbage can where uh, people could drop off their, their cups on the drive through and uh, he said that they, that was removed. And uh, so he commonly used to use that garbage can. And uh, so here we are, there's quite a line up here. Um, but I don't see a garbage can at the drive-thru. I see one at the front doors. Right there. But I don't think anybody's going to pull in, use that, and then pull out. Um, I suspect that all the trash and garbage from Tim's that we see are from the drive-thru. And without the ability for them to drop that off, uh, you know, a lot of people are daily uh, users of Tim Hortons. And uh, so, yeah, so that's pathetic. Um, I couldn't believe it when he, when he told me. And uh, so we've just seen for ourselves. Um, I don't think Tim's cares, to be honest with you. And so I think that given all the Tim's trash, something needs to be done. You know, there's another one. Um, so yeah, in my short drive, I saw five uh, Tim's cups. And so that's really just unacceptable. And I know we should blame the people who are dumping it, the people who don't give a crap, who just throw their trash everywhere. I mean, you see it all the time. But Tim's has a responsibility too, I think. Um, I think they should assist and I think they should put a garbage can right back at that drive through uh, So that's that's my feeling this morning and uh, well, be it as it may. <laughs> Au revoir.